Yo guys, welcome back to another GTA 5 Online video and today we're going to be talking about the Orbital Cannon 5 ways I'm going to be showing y'all how to not to get killed by the Orbital Cannon but before we get onto it, just give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new I'm giving uh, two modded accounts once we hit 500 sub subscribers so let's get right on to the video Okay, so basically, if you have tryhards running after you, or you have someone that's in their orbital cannon, and they really want to kill you in the free mode session in GTA Online, basically, the first vehicle will save you will be the RC Bandito. You can find this on the Southern San Andreas website. And basically, if you get orbitaled in your RC car, basically it'll blow up the RC car and it doesn't kill you. So you're temporarily off the map with the RC car. So if that person orbitals you in the RC car, it blows up the RC car and it doesn't count as a kill because you're not even a, not even in the map. Basically, you're like controlling it through like a little controller. So technically it doesn't kill you so the rc car is a uh, number one way to dodge an orbital cannon from dying so if you're about to die from someone using an orbital cannon i recommend pulling out the rc bandito you see how i got orbitaled so basically you just spawn right in and it doesn't count as a kill because he's blowing up the rc car and he doesn't blow you up so let's get right on to the next item slash vehicle that will save you from an, an orbital cannon. So the next thing that will save you from an, an orbital strike will be the MOC, the Mobile Operation Center. So if your friend has an mobile operation or you don't have one or you do have one, in case you don't want to get killed by an orbital cannon, basically all you have to do is just enter inside the back of the cab so you'll enter the long trailer and like in the back so basically you just walk to the back and enter so when the orbital cannon does hit the trailer it blows up the trailer and it doesn't kill you that's how strong the moc is slash the mobile operation center so if the cannon blows up the trailer it blows up the trailer and not you so that's an other way you could be saved from an orbital cannon and not dying so you're gonna spawn in after the MOC gets blown up and it gets killed but you don't get killed so that's another way to survive an orbital cannon the third way is the avenger so if you do own an avenger and someone's in your orbital cannon you could get saved by this avenger aircraft and if you do not own it i recommend just telling your friend to invite you before you get an orbital cannon killed in a gta online session so basically if you do get blown up by that orbital cannon um just go to the back of the avenger so it's going to be like the same feature when the orbital cannon does hit the avenger when both of you slash your friends are inside the little cab in the back basically it's going to blow up the aircraft and basically you and your friends are going to spawn like on the ground while the vehicle slash aircraft is blown up while that person left the session thinking they killed you but they never did they blew up the aircraft instead of you so that's another way on how to survive an orbital cannon strike so number four will be the sea breeze the sea breeze could survive an orbital strike yes you're thinking how can a sea breeze survive in an orbital cannon just a regular plane aircraft but there's like a glitch slash like mod on this on how to survive it so basically if you do not own a sea breeze i recommend buying it so with the sea breeze all you want to do is just fly upside down with the sea breeze slash aircraft and land into the water upside down so you see how it's floating upside down right so when the orbital cannon hits it's like a weird glitch so when it hits it's gonna not blow up the aircraft or nothing or kill you it's like so amazing the sea breeze so i really recommend buying it so watch this when the orbital cannon hits the sea breeze it looks like it blew it up but it doesn't and it's perfectly fine so let's get right on to the next one so this is number five on how to survive an orbital cannon strike 
So my favorite is the wall breach. Wall breaches could save you from a lot from tryhards and orbital cannon. So I'm gonna show you a location where in case you did I'm about to get orbital, you could just run over there slash fly over there. So basically it's on one of my videos I posted on the tugboat. So basically it's this location on the map. If you have not seen it, just go to my one of my videos. It should be um called new wall breaches and it should be showing the tugboat. So I'm gonna show you this location. This is another location you could get saved by an orbit cannon. So basically you just hop in right at the corner, like the way I'm doing it. So you just run and jump. So once you're inside this wall breach, basically the orbital cannon is gonna tr hit you, but it's not, cause it's gonna hit the rooftop. Then you still got the tugboat protecting you. So there's gonna be a tugboat, then there's gonna be a rooftop. So the orbital cannon is gonna hit the rooftop and you're pretty much protected from the rooftop then it still has to go to the tugboat and it can't because it can go to two surfaces so that's an other way on how to dodge an over the cannon so you don't need a tugboat but i'm just showing you a wall breach if you don't know a wall, wall breach already so this is another way also i do got other videos i'm working on i'm working on a direct mode so the other one my other video has been patched already, so I'm going to work on a new method and new easier. So I'm going to try to make it like a 8 or 9 minute video. So it won't be too long for you. So it could be straight to the point. So stay tuned for that. I'll be working on direct mode. And I got another video I'm going to post right after this one in the next hour. So turn on the post notifications. Subscribe if you're new. Give this video a thumbs up if you did not know about like on how to survive the orbital cannon strikes. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll be safe out there. Catch you on the next video. Peace.